on Twitch and YouTube, as, as, as I normally am. Don't know why I announce that every single time. But yeah, I'm playing Pokemon. Uh, I know the last stream we did was Pokemon, but I'm doing it again because I want to try and get the main game out of the way before the DLC. So, uh, I'll have a break from it tomorrow, but after tomorrow, most of my streams will be... Um, will be... Pokemon and stuff because I want to get the... Uh, I want to get everything finished and boxed off by uh, by the time it's DLC time, which is five days time actually. So I don't know when's the seventeenth. Seventeenth is Wednesday, so I need to get the game finished by Wednesday basically. So that's going to be very fun. Going to be very fun indeed. I need to think about whether I want to highlight the series. I'm never going to highlight. I'm definitely going to upload the raw DLC because um, you know content. But I don't know what to do about the main game. I might just put the game main game into one big highlight one day. So I got all these people waving at me from like two days ago, which is <laughs> funny. They're all just here. They're all just vibing. <clears throat> so yeah, I'll just wait around for a bit for a few more people to join, and then we'll we'll get to it basically. Oh, one thing worth mentioning, I'll mention it when uh, more people get here. I have a... I've gotten a team together. I've gotten quite the team together, if I do say so myself. I've gotten quite the assortment of Pokemon together, ready for my final team. Which I'm looking forward to showing off. So I'll just wait for some people to get in and I'll show off my final team. I just want to open my bag and accidentally show it. Uh... Oh, Pokemon Camp would de de most definitely show all my team members. I'll check the Pokedex. I've not actually checked my Pokedex yet. Oh, there's like a bunch of Pokemon here. Yeah, okay, cool. Wild area, yeah. Quillfish. We all love a bit of Quillfish. Forgot we have a Grookey. I forgot we have a Grookey. We can like evolve all our starters. We should evolve Grookey at some point. I'll use Grookey in post game, maybe. I don't know. I might use Grookey in post game. I don't, I don't have a Caterpie. Why do I not have a Caterpie? But I have a Metapod and a Butterfree. That's weird. I, of course. I thought I caught a Corviknight. I was doing raid battles to level up my Pokemon. To get XP candies to level up my Pokemon. And, uh, yeah, I must have just, uh... Not had a Corviknight. Or, there was a Corviknight and I didn't catch it, I don't think. I thought I did. Which is weird. Have I not seen the, evo the evolution of Squirvet? That's okay. Alright, I must have not. That's weird. Of course, the Ludicolo line. And have we just not seen the Nuzly for a shift tree either? Oh, I need to... I need to do stuff. I need to, like, complete the Pokedex. Right. And then, yeah. Everything else after here is just a blur. Of course we have <laughs> the Wooper line. Um, and then again, we've not seen a match matchup or a Machamp. I need to I need to do a bit of a gap filling on this if I want to complete the Pokedex. If I want if I want to complete the Pokedex, which I'm not going to do because you know <laughs> that would make me a nerd. Um, yeah. Anyway, um, I do believe yes. All right, I'm going to show off my team. I'm going to show my team, and uh, oh oh. <laughs> okay, yeah. I didn't intend to do that. Oopsie Daisy. I didn't intend to do that either. Stop. I've accidentally shown my team twice without wanting to show people. Anyway, I'll show off the team now. But if anyone else decides to uh, have a gender, then we'll I'll show I'll show them when they join. So, the final team, the final Pokemon team that we are going to be using is, as you can see in front of you, they're all faces we've seen before, um, some more recently than others. Um, I've leveled them up quite a bit off camera using experience candies, you know, the legitimate way. <laughs> uh, definitely. Uh, so let's start off. First team member, we have Slommy, the Inteleon. Fast boy, as you can see. Uh, uh, they've still got pounds. They've still got pounds at level, level 60. I do not know why I kept pound on them. I need to go and see if there's any better moves. Sucker Punch we won't need either, Liquidation. It, it's a physical. It's a special. It's a physical attack. It's a spe uh, It's a special attacker. Got there eventually. But it only has one special attacking move. So that's stupid. 
we have Ice Coffee for Dalmanitan. Dalmanitan. Um, and it's gotten quite a few moves. It's gotten quite the arsenal, you know. Uh, you've got a Chase Scarf. Geared up, ready for the fight. We've got Bacon the Cinderace. Libero, hidden ability, Cinderace. Uh, powerhouse, proper powerhouse. Look at this. They've got some good spread here. Got double edge, double kick, pyro ball, bounce. Need to think if there's a better move I can teach it other than, other than double kick. I'm sure there is somewhere. And then maybe another one other than double edge. I don't know. We've got the girlies. We've got the squad. He. It's he. Um, it is he. We've got girlies. We've got the squad, you know, on the way to a night out. Um, fast again. Uh, they learn Megahorn. So I'll have Megahorn into the first impression, which is cool. Uh, they have close combat rehearsal. Bye. Yes. Um, and then we have uh, you no know, retreat. I think we need a few more. I don't think we need reversal. Don't know why I have reversal. You never know. It might be might be good in a certain situation if we need it. And then we have Salami. We've not seen Salami in a while. We've not seen Salami in quite a while. So I'm happy to announce that they're back. And they're better than ever. Look, I mean, they're still like a... Special attack. Special attack is atrocious. I mean, uh, to be honest, it's not too bad in comparison. Um, I, I'm quite happy with the move set uh, that Salami's got. To be honest, um, I finally gave it better moves other than Mega Drain and the what was it like? I don't know, Water Gun <laughs> that had up flipping level 40. I gave it a lot of XP candies, and now it's gotten some good moves. And then we have Floodlet, old friend. Old friend of the uh, of the team, uh, given to us by Con, by David. Um, we have him here. This is going to be the Pokemon that carries us through the entire game, basically. Uh, yeah, that's all I can really say. It's going to carry us. Um, I need to think of a better move to teach Slummy real quick, uh, and then once I think of a better move for Slummy, uh, better moves for Slummy, we'll be on our way to the stadium. That's one thing I didn't quite look at. But I'm going to go and do that now. So, let's teach Slummy a good old move. And then we'll be on our way to w Winden. At some point. Uh, let's see. What do you learn that's a good move? You learn Soap. You learn U-Turn. You literally learn nothing good, do you? You don't learn anything good. Uh, I'll just be a moment. I just need to yell at someone. Right, so basically, we've got nothing other than, like, Water Pulse. We could give it Soak, don't know why. We could give it Rain Dance, don't know why. So, yeah, I guess we're just stuck with this. I mean, it's not got bad special attack. It's not got bad physical attack. It's got, like, the same physical attack as a uh, Ludicult uh, Salami has a special attack. So, it's not that bad. We'll go with it. We'll go with it. It's a good spread, you know? But anyway, I'm going to go go on the train to Wyndham and I need to very quickly go and run and grab a cup of tea whilst I do. So I'm going to go grab my cup of tea when I get on the train and then I'll be back. Oh, wait till... Oh, God. Yeah, 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 Hop. Yeah, it took you two days, Hop, because I was gone for two. It took you two days to beat him. Look at him. I don't... He's, he's got such a weird fashion sense like his hoodie i don't get it it's, it looks like it's a hood from both sides it's like a two-way hoodie yeah let's go and get on the train right okie dokie i'll be back in a minute I'm back. 
I can see Joy-Con drifts being busy trying to sabotage me. Right. Hi, dude, man powered by dudes. Uh, welcome to the stream. Oh, and thank you for the follow. Thank you very much. You fortunately, you fortunately caught us at the beginning of the stream, so we'll be having fun. Right. Who are you? Not only people are like, oh, you're, you're a snowbird. That's cool. Uh, who are you? Okay, yeah, that's insightful. Um, right, so this is like a snowy route. Uh, bacon needs a bit of love. We'll move bacon to the front of the party for now <clears throat> and see what we can do. I've got a cup of tea and some chocolate, so we're good. Ooh. Hmm. Very interesting. So, I've not been to this route for a long time. Time to go in a... Oh god, oh god, it's coming towards me. Oh god, Jesus Christ. Um, time to go in a... Go to Wyndham, I guess. Oh god, it's still here. They're everywhere. Oh Jesus Christ, I need to run. Oh! Ah! It was so fast. I mean, I guess we can find the crash there, so we can just use it for experience, I guess. What level are you? Oh yeah, we're far over levels. We may as well catch it. I also caught a lot of Pokeballs for this. Got a lot of Pokeballs for this, so I can do some catching whilst I'm uh, waiting. <clears throat> and we have caught it. I don't know what to call it, but we got it. In the bag. Right. I'm gonna call it orb. Just just orb. Why not? Why not call it orb? Hmm. And we will uh, send it to the box. To the box with you. Also, whilst I was catching Pokemon, let me just heal and to heal. Uh whilst I was catching Pokemon, I also ended up getting a couple of uh uh Pokemon from raid battles and stuff, because you know I just leech up over the people's success. <laughs> Yeah, uh, on Pokemon. Definitely not in real life. Um, <clears throat> so, I believe we have got uh, nothing in here. I believe it's uh, yeah. Don't know why I call it yeah. Yeah, the Copper Raja, that yeah, which is Gigantamax. We've got a uh, dog. Why do I call it dog? Watching this on the Twitch app because you don't have your laptop. Twitch mobile app is atrocious. I know. Um, I used to have it, and I hated it. Um, but this is Dog the Lapras. <laughs> and this is a Ringle. I don't know, it just made, gave me Ringo Star vibes. And uh, Pickle Rick. Um, <clears throat> and this is the rest of the team. But this is the team we've gone for. In the end. Bacon, Ice Coffee, Slummy, Girlies, Salami Makes a Return, and Flublet. So that's basically it, and I've leveled them up. So that's, uh, and that's what we've got. Um... I also just remember. Oh, hello, Mr. Man. I also just remembered that um, I showed off my team last stream, so I didn't need to go to the effort to try and hide it from the while. Um, I have to watch my phone upright so I can type in chat and have the screen made smaller. Ah, oh, fair enough. Stinky looking mobiles. I'm gonna not fight you. I have other things to fight. I'm going to lose PP on Pyro Ball really fast. I should have gotten like a move that is also decent. Because I'm not going to need Double Edge. So, I don't know. I'll see if there's any moves Bacon can learn. Snarl? Bacon can learn Snarl, but it's a special move. Why, why can Bacon learn Snarl? Why can a, a Cinderace of all things learn Snarl? That's so weird. I can learn U-Turn. Like a stab U-turn. I don't know how useful that would be. 
Use PP ups if you have them. Ha 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 ha. PP yolk because PP ups. I like that. That's a good one. You can learn snore. Reversal. But we don't need it. Uh, you can learn Zen headbutt. That could, that probably would be more useful to be honest. It's likely that that can be useful. So probably use that. Um, I might replace Bounce with Zen Headbutt and Double Edge with U-Turn, maybe. Uh, that could be useful, but then I have, like... No, 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 no. I think another Pokemon has U-Turn. Uh, none, none of my Pokemon at the moment have U-Turn. Let me have a check. Yeah, none of them at the moment have U-Turn, so I'll give Bacon U-Turn. I'll replace it with Double Edge. So then I have Zen Headbutt and U-Turn and, and Pyro Ball and Double Kick. And it's Libero, too, so it's kind of good. Um... I should have given it to my other Pokemon as well. Because there's some moves on Darmanitan I can't see Darmanitan using. Like, I'm allowed to use Icicle Crash and Ice Punch. Thrash is useful. Superpower is also quite useful. Uh, we'll go with... I think we'll get rid of Ice Punch. Yeah, I'll put U-Turn on Darm. And I'm going to put U-Turn on Slommy as well. Because... Slommy still knows pounds for some reason. So, I'm going <laughs> to... Unless, unless we just keep pounds for the bit, we could always just keep bound for the bit. Yeah, um, I'm gonna get rid of pounds. Oh, we'll get rid of pounds. <laughs> oh, I was tempted, but I thought actually we could go for the ya uh, for the yaoi hands anime moment. I might reteach you a pound. I don't know. Before the final battle, I can reteach most of my Pokemon like the Oh god, he's coming. Oh Jesus Christ, I'm gonna I'd rather take on the trainer. I'm sorry, I just saw flipping Galarian Mr. Mime running at me. And I wanted to scream. Absolutely terrifying. I was in so much fear. Gardevoir. Also, quick question. My Patreon slash Kofi and friend code in the corner of the screen. Um, do people uh, not mind seeing that? Do we do we do a Charizard? I'll kill it with a pound. I'll reteach. Uh, I'll reteach. Uh, been slummy Yowie hands McGee uh, for pin pound, and then I'll have him take down Gigantamax Charizard for pound. Uh, we're going to U-turn out of this because I don't really want to take on God of War at the moment. Stab bug. Would you like Pokemon? Uh, um. I'm, I'm alright for the time being. Oh, that one hit KO'd, of course. Um, I'm fine. Don't worry. I've got a decent... I've got a decent Pokemon already. I don't want to, like, receive too many handouts. Keep your Pokemon. Um, so, yeah. But, yeah, don't, I, you don't, don't feel like you have to give me Pokemon. Don't worry. Oh, and then you're here. Forgot about you. You're just standing here. I'm gonna, gonna approach you from behind. Look. Uh, mm-hmm. Okay, um, great. I, I, I just really like how the, the hiker class looks for some reason. I do not know why, I just really like how they look. Very fancy. So I think Steelix, you are just, yeah, your Steelix is pure steel, so what am I saying? I can just Pyro Ball you, or I can double kick you, but double kick does nothing, so we're going to do Pyro Ball. Skadoosh. Oh, I thought it hung. I thought it hung on with fucking sturdy. Then I would have. Uh, I'm gonna switch into if it's like a water type. I'll, if it's like a rock type, I'll switch into slummy. It's mudsdale, so it's ground type. I'm gonna switch into slummy. Oh, salami. We'll we'll whip out salami. Salami's not got much action recently, so we're gonna give salami a bit of action. I'm glad to have him back. I just realised they hold them to the hat as they're coming out. I love it. Like they hold them to the little sombrero to make sure it doesn't come off. I'm going to use Energy Ball. Wearing this new move that I just taught it. Good damage. Slimy always comes through. <clears throat> Douglas, you down. I love his face that he pulls when he, when he loses. He's like, Ugh! It's so funny. Uh, Duraludon spawn on this route. Oh, Bal Obama Snow spawn on this route. Wait. Why is there only a trainer tips thing here? I'm, I'm 
stuck between such a rock and a hard place. Oh god, there's so many. Oh god, get me out of here. Please, please, please. Oh Jesus. Okay, I'm good. If you lose, his lose pose is DK's down taunt. <laughs> that reminds me, I need to play Smash Brothers sometime. Do I, I, I should play Smash Brothers tomorrow on stream. Because I mean, I could do Animal Crossing, but I've done quite a bit of Animal Crossing recently. Um, but I'm probably still going to do it. I need to do Smash Brothers, and I've not done Mario Maker in a while. But I've got Mario Maker planned, Mario Maker stuff planned for off stream. Stream Smash vs viewers, I've not played Smash in a long time, so people will love to see that. I'm going to use U-turn. Why not? Instantly want to kill. I need to do it. I might do Smash Stream versus viewers. Which reminds me, on the top topic of the uh, viewer related things, you have an amiibo. You can farm for views. Epic. <laughs> okay. Um, but like, um, I've recently got my second Patreon. Uh, well, my, my Patreon payment for the month. So that's cool. So I'll probably um, I've got an idea for. Uh, I want to set up a Java Minecraft server. I need to still think about it, but I might want to set up a Java Minecraft server. You have a clay doll. Uh, I'm going to keep my current Pokemon because I can just hit you with a, a U-turn. I'll just hit you with a U-turn. And then I should hopefully do damage. Big damage. But yeah, I need to do I need to do things like that. I also figured out why Discord is so quiet when I stream. It's because I had the output volume really low. Itarosa's free hosting, server's a tad slow. Well, yeah, um, I, I could use a free server, but um, I've got, um, I want. I have plans for wanting to use a more permanent one, but whatever. Oh, that's a Mr. Mine. So uh, that's why I'm looking, I think looking towards paying for one using Patreon stuff, which I have. I can afford like a, a, good, a, a decent one. Um, but it would just be for small things. Uh, I am going to run from the battle. Found by who just percent world war, world record run. Yeah, I've used a uh, whatever, you, however you pronounce it, for uh, with with friends for like small friend servers. I'm just chilling, and vibing. But I've um, give me a chat. No ball games. Oh, I don't know. It's just a joke. Because uh, like sometimes on parks they say like oh uh, no ball games allowed. So I'm like okay, no balls. That sounds really weird out of context, actually. Yeah, I might, ch I might change that. Just realise it's really weird out of context. Um, but yeah. Oh, you're a, you're a flying type, and uh, I'm, I could probably take you out with a Zen head. Probably, I could probably take out this power with a Zen head. But change no ball games to just no balls. Do you want to have a friendly battle? Um, I'm not doing um, battles and stuff at the moment. Oh, okay, tailwind me, all right. Um, I'm not doing friendly battles for the moment. Um, my plan is to try and get uh, shield completed as fast as I can, ready for ready for the DLC. So it's just going to be like story-related things uh, for the time being. So today's stream and probably uh, the next two Pokemon streams I do will be at least like story related things and then uh after that i'll be doing um dlc and then i'll probably start doing a uh, friendly battles and stuff nocturnal it's like a nocturnal owl because all owl well most owls are nocturnal and the battle ready team then hit you up you have a lot of mons uh, I mean, yeah, you could always give me like a um, one of the code things and I can like register it because I've done that on Sword with a couple of teams. Um, I'm not really too into like the into serious battling. I just like battling for the fun of it. Um, I mean, I'll I'll try and get like a good natured Pokemon, but I won't like competitively breed for one. I'll like do stuff and things. I don't know. This guy's got a weird pose. He's like, Ugh. I like him. Oh, I like his little salute, though. That's kind of cool. Corviknight. I love Corviknight. Spooky. Alright. 
so duplicate your thing. I'm just gonna use Pyro Ball. You can always heal when I get the. Yo, it's the guy from Twilight Wings. Yeah, it is. It's like because that's that's like what most of the uh, taxi people are. That's cool. God, the most recent episode's really good. I really, I, I, for some, the art style in the recent episode looked a bit different for some reason. I don't know why. It just looks, it just looks like different from usual. Uh, but I, I don't know. That might just be my eyes being weird. I can't believe the Pokemon, birds from Pokemon into a real thing. Do you mean flying types? Yeah, they, because they invented like flying types and made them into birds, like a real thing. It, right. Up topic, but it took me. A good, I don't know how many years to realize that Flygon's eyes, like Flygon's eye protectors, weren't its eyes. I used to think Flygon's like eye protectors were its real eyes. Stream is hella fast today. Good. Is it like not laggy then? That's really good. Oh, just as I spoke, I saw um, OBS have a bit of a ooh, ooh wobbly. Um, hmm. Yeah. How did you delay? That's good. Um, I'm very happy. I mean, YouTube probably can't say anything different. YouTube is probably equally as bad as it normally is. Um, yeah, it took me like until uh, wait, where, where like the games. It took me till the 3D games, and then I realised that Flygon just didn't have massive red eyes. YouTube, YouTube on a Tuesday. Haha. <laughs> oh oh. Do you remember? Do you remember that joke? God, that was a joke. That was one hell of a joke. Like, you're a massive Bursic. You are scurry. I, I would have kicked you with my with my Cinderace. There's something about the Bursic. Honestly, when Gen 5 first came out, I thought Bursic was a really, really cool Pokemon. It still sort of looks cool. But, like, uh, you're you in my tube here, pal. You're absolutely you in my tube. Oh, you're level 55. Jeez. Oh, you are level 55. It's terrifying. Why are Pokemon so strong? Like, do wild Pokemon like scale or something? No, they probably no, they don't. Of course they don't. Nintendo's not that smart. I'd use the heal ball accidentally, but we'll go with it. I'm going to use a Pokeball or a Premier Ball, but I went for the heal ball. You could catch it. And would you look at that? Really appling my bees. Damn. My bees are apples. My oranges, Eely Peely. Eely Peely? Easy Peeler. I just got them mixed up. Yeah, they scale to like level 60. Uh, yeah, these guys are high leveled. Uh, Burtick, we're going to call them... Grrr. <laughs> Yay. Um, yeah. I don't know. I need to play games where like... It Wild, like, trainers and stuff do scale. Clover, uh, Pokemon Clover is scalable, like, wild Pokemon. And, uh, scalable, not scalable wild Pokemon, scalable battles in the post game. Uh, in the main game, it just, it's all static levels and stuff. Uh, let's see. You're really cocking my balls. I, mmm, mmm, okay. <laughs> right. Okay, we'll stick with bacon for the remainder of this route. You can just, like, Pyro Ball and Zen Headbutt our way through it. I like how it learns Zen Headbutt because it's like a uh, head in a ball, you know? I like that. Nice touch. Nice touch. Gigalith? Oh, uh, we can take this down with a double kick. Actually, no, it's double kick. What am I saying? Double kick is really. It can. It, it barely knocks out Pokemon like Gigalith. I might just do a cheeky little. I can always, I'll U-turn it. I'll probably knock it out. If it's super effective. And it's a it's stab bug and I'm like eight levels higher than it. Uh, no, we did like half damage. I'll take that. That's good damage. I'll swap into... Salami. Salami. Rock slide or... Uh. Is it me? I just like Gigalith's mouth. I didn't realize Gigalith had a mouth like that until the, the these generations. I thought it just didn't have a mouth. I just didn't think it would have a mouth, but it, it does, which is weird. 
He just fires water onto his controllers. I love that. Yeah, I just, like, Gigalith's mouth reminds me of that one gif where it's, like, the lady laughing and then her mouth just, like, opens really unnaturally. Is it ethical to eat Pokemon? Uh, in some cultures. I imagine. Somewhere, some places in the world it's probably ethical to eat Pokemon. I don't know. I'm doing this really cool uh, GND campaign at the moment with Pokemon. Uh, where it's like, Pokemon emerged in the real world. And like, but they're all like very deadly. So like most of the world is being killed off because of Pokemon are deadly. Uh, <laughs> I love his face. Um, those people are just vegan or do they eat like, I mean, I imagine people still eat like Pokemon. Which is like how people still have pets. I imagine they probably, oh yeah, people eat Slowpoke tails. Um, and probably that's harmless to the Slowpokes. I mean, they would make it. I imagine some Pokemon are like bred for like consumption and some are like bred for being battled. Um, I imagine like if you catch a wild Pokemon, um, then they, they won't be too worried about like, oh no, my trainer's going to eat me. It'd be like, you know, if you, if you caught it then, but I don't know. I, I, it'd be complicated law. I would like to imagine that that's just the case. And it's not just... I, I, I don't know how it, how else it could work. I imagine... I, I, just, I just don't know. Because I've, I've seen, like, meat in the Pokemon world. <laughs> the gay laugh on the street. Food industry doesn't know what's coming. Yeah, they're gonna... They're gonna see, like... So much food. I mean... I, I, I just... I, 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 we've definitely seen, like... Because we see, like, burgers, unless it's corn burgers or something. Unless everything's corn. Because, I mean, the eating of slowpoke tails is seen as, like, oh, the selling of it illegally is seen, like, taboo. But the selling of, any selling of anything illegally is seen taboo, so... I don't know. Miltank burgers? Honestly, after flipping what Whitney put me through, I would eat a thousand of those. Sod the burgers. days been, by the way, chat. <laughs> Have we all the good days? Hope we all the good days. <clears throat> I think we're nearly. I think we're at the end of the route now. There's two more. I think these. I think, I think these are the same two interviewers that interviewed us at like the beginning of the like, beginning of our journey. Probably. It's been a while. Oh yeah, of course. They're here. Here they are. Clink Clang and he- oh yeah, it's easy to say. I remember these Pokemon. I remember these. Bacon and Ice Coffee. Ready to deal the damage. Let's kick this one. I'll kick a ball at it. Oh, let's not do that. Let's Icicle Crash, Heliolisk. Fast boy, go on. Oh, big damage. You feel people had a problem with the slowpoke thing because they weren't bred to be eaten. Came into the natural habitat and started taking the tails illegally. Yeah. I feel like in the Pokemon world, like, everything, like, of course, aside from Pokemon eating Pokemon because that's just like the world, like the circle of life or whatever, it's like Pokemon are probably breeded for it. The milk type you see on a ranch are probably bred. Some are bred for milk and imagine some are bred for killing, you know? Pokemon ranches and po so Pokemon slaughterhouse isn't too far out. I just hope it's ethical, you know? Because I feel like it's for the, you know, people have chickens as people have chickens as pets, and people have like um, chickens as, you know, a food source. So I feel like having Pokemon as pets and then Pokemon as food. People, people have Pokemon as food source. I wouldn't say it's too far out, you know? People can have Wulu as like dear partners, and I imagine. In the same way that someone who has a pet chicken looks at someone who uh, eats, like, slaughters chicken for a living, you know, like a farmer. Um, someone who probably owns a Wulu as a pet probably doesn't look at a person who farms Wulu for their meat with too much disgust. But then how do Pokemon feel about it? 
Like, because we know Pokemon are more sentient, are more like aware than our our animals. So that's a weird one. It's a weird one. So like the humans, I imagine they're probably fine with it. Or like in in the context of the human world, yeah, that's fine. But you <laughs> would you eat a Wooloo kebab? Uh, I don't know. I mean, in again in the real world context, yes, it's just going to be like a lamb kebab. It, it just does make you wonder. Like, they could just say, oh yeah, there's real, real animals on top of Pokemon, but like, uh, I don't, I don't believe that. I, it's just, it's a weird one. It's a weird, weird, weird one. On one hand, I want to say I'd be fine with it, but then I'd be like, if you were to put, if you were to give me a Wooloo as a Pokemon partner for like years, and then I were to go to a restaurant and like order a Wooloo kebab in front of my Wooloo, how would my Wooloo feel? My ruler would probably hate me after that. Be like, you eat a tepic chop? Yeah. I mean, to be honest, I would I would just eat I would eat Pokemon, but like I don't know. It's 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 evidently something that like people need to live off of. It that it's a weird one. It's a weird one. I don't I don't I don't like thinking about how that how eating meat would work in the Pokemon world. I'm just gonna go with the, the whole headcanon that, you know, probably real 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 animals still exist in that world and it's like sheep. But like then Wooloo and Mareep evolved from that, from like millions of years of breeding. I'll 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 say that to feel better about myself. But then would Pokemon have a, mu <laughs> a mutual understanding with the animals? Oh, it's so complicated. Oh, it's like uh, I don't want to think about it anymore. <laughs> it makes me it makes me feel bad. Actually, no, it doesn't make me feel bad. It just makes me feel awkward. I feel like uh, movements for like veganism will be more popular in the Pokemon world because you actually form a you actually form a uh, a bond with them. Hey, Cannon, Galarian Zapdos is only legendary because people hunted them to make the best chicken tenders on Earth. Um, I I like that. I I I, I think I yeah. So like, I had to evolve to be able to run faster. And like be more agile. I still don't like how most of them retain flying. When I think about it, I think the typings are cool. I like the sort of like types type circle they've gone with. But at the same time, I really wish they like made them kept kept the ice flat get the ice fire and electric types. Cause I mean then like those would have just been extra typings. Cause I mean, you've still got the Arctic Malt and like Zap in their names. And that doesn't really apply anymore because, you know, they've got, um, thingy. Birds are kind of hard to make not flying. Zapdos would make sense. But, like, uh, you know, it's been, it's been done with, like, aquatic Pokemon. Like, Stunfisk is a fish. Uh, it's been, it's been done with, like, dragons. Or dragon-inspired Pokemon. So, Yeah. It, it, it's, just, it's just weird. I, I think it would have been cool. I would have personally liked it. Because, like, they are... They're less known... I mean, they are known as the legendary birds, I suppose. But, yeah. Oh, wait a second. Are we, are we battling right now? Or are we just going out for the thing, thingy? Are we actually... Are we battling? Wait. No, let's give them the last level, especially with the, like, Delmizers, where they get stabbed. Why am I... Why did their Pokemon camp? That's weird. I might... Joy-Con driven. Stop. Um, stab boost from flying moves. It will be that will be good to be honest. They should they should do something like that. I, it's just it's okay. My controller's gravitating towards the flipping door, so evidently I should go in.